Hola. Hola. Bienvenidos. Bienvenidos. Ah, ¿A qué? A ah, nuestro vídeo. A ah, nuestro vídeo, sí. Well, we're here. Oh, bueno, ¿qué tal, Cindy? ¿Cómo estás? Eh, bien, estoy muy bien, gracias. ¿Sí? Sí, ah, sí. ¿Qué haces Fenomenal. estos días? Estudiar, mucho. Estudio, Estudiar. Sí, ah. para la carrera. Ah, sí, es tu último año. Mi ¿verdad? último año. Wow. Y como sí. dice mi hijo, uno más y, y no, no más. más. Sí. <ríe> no más. ¿No vas a hacer tu máster o algo no. así? No. no. No tengo ni ganas ni tiempo. Vale. ¿Y qué tal estás tú, Gordon? Estoy muy bien, muy bien. Sí, fenomenal. No, no, no podría estar mejor. ¿Y a qué verdad. te dedicas estos días? A escribir mucho <ríe> muy bien. y a muchas clases de Skype. Muy bien. Sí, porque... ¿Por qué? Now moving on to English, because we're here to announce, way finally, Victor's Adventures is now available online to get a hold of. Way Muy bien, finally. <laughs> <coughs> only, it has only taken three years. Yes. So that's all. Three years of... Um, that's nothing. But three years as a hobby book, not, not, not three years writing it. Goodness, I, I, I'm a bit better than that. Yeah. It took about, what, two and a half to write it? <laughs> <laughs> well, it's available. Victor's uh, Adventures in Spain or Las Aventuras de Victor in España. Sí. Okay, what's special about this book, if there is something special, is that it's a parallel text story book. Okay, and the idea is that it starts with very simple English Very, very simple English. <laughs> and very simple Spanish as well. It starts with very simple Spanish um, and then it takes you, as you go through, it takes you sort of on a journey as it starts to become more complex. As you learn the structures, it becomes more complex. When it finishes, really it's at quite a good level. But it starts off nice and sim simply. This beautiful lady here does all of the audio. So Cynthia has recorded all of the audio, yes? Yes, I have. Big job, yes? Yes. Mm -hmm. Big job. So, what you can do is you can follow along and listen to the Spanish as you read the Spanish. And right alongside, uh, I'll show you an example. So you've got the story here. I don't know if you can see that. You've got the, the Spanish here and then you've got the English directly alongside. Okay, everything translated. Uh, what other things has it got, Cynthia? It has um, grammar. Grammar, yeah. But easy grammar, not not complex grammar. Sure. Um, the grammar that you find in the actual book to help with the book. Yeah, the idea is with story. with every chapter that that you you come across before the chapter, there's a there's a little um, lesson on some of the things that you're going to see, and also some uh, a little test as well to see whether you've you've managed to understand it. Okay. Um, and then we have some idioms as well. Ah, some idioms. Oh, what are idioms, Cynthia? Uh, no, and this is part of my university course. <laughs> <laughs> Tell us idioms. what an idiom is. I wouldn't. I don't even know how to explain it. Idioms are expressions. Expressions that are fixed. Mm. Expressions that really don't translate very well, but everybody knows what they mean. Like, uh, you'll get that wrapped around your neck. Exactly. Yeah. You'll shoot yourself in the foot. Mm -hmm. A couple of idioms in Spanish, Cynthia. Uh, Gordon habla por los codos. Uh -huh. um, y Gordon se pone las botas. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so, so it's got some idioms as well. It's, all the idioms that are used in the book are that also in the back with some ex examples and explanations of, of what they actually mean. Um, also, there's a vocab builder. Uh, that's for vocabulary and for verbs as well. So all of the verbs, the main verbs that you're going to read in the book, you'll also have, um, there's an audio that comes with it that helps you learn how to remember those verbs and remember those words. Um, so there's, and there's also, ooh, a bit of extra stuff as well. For those people who like that kind of thing, um, I, I don't know if you're aware, but on, on the side, on the side, I do therapy and hypnotherapy. So what I've done is I've created a couple of audios about getting into the learning zone to help you to get into a better place before you start to learn. And it's something that you can use not only when you're learning Spanish, but anything, really, anything that you want to learn. It's a great 
little, uh, there are two audios, one that shows you how to do it, and then one that's kind of like a guided meditation type of thing that helps to embed it into your unconscious mind. Ooh. Very yeah. good. Mm. So that's there as well. Um, what you do is if you, if you were to get this off Amazon, it's on all of the Amazon sites. Uh, it doesn't come with CDs. The audio is, is downloaded directly um, from our website. And inside the first page, you'll see the, the web address just to go to and download it there. Nice and simple, go straight to your PC or your tablet or whatever, whatever. So we really hope that you enjoy the, the book. Uh, we've put a lot of um, effort and a lot of love into it. Yeah, and a sure. lot of sweat. <laughs> so it's uh, it's now down to you. So, muchas gracias, Cynthia, muchas gracias por todo, todo lo que has hecho. A ti, Gordon. Sí. Muchas gracias por el libro. Sí. Y nos vemos pronto. Y nos vamos. Adiós. Adiós.